Hello my frugal friends and welcome to another grocery haul video. I do realize that you just saw a grocery haul like a couple days ago, but that's TV land. In real life land, that last grocery haul was a week ago and this one is a week later. So this one's more recent. I was holding it because I had all the other videos. Anyway, you know what I'm saying. Today I went to Smith's and Winco and I found some awesome clearance deals. I had to pick them up. Even though my freezers are full, I'm just gonna like keep jamming stuff in there and make it work. Make it work. So I'm super excited to show you what I got. I will explain why I got what I got and what we will be eating from these items in the coming week. And I will also make a video on that too. So look for that in a while. Okay, here we go. <laughs> at Winco, I spent $11.87. And at Smith's, I spent $27.69 after tax. So right at about 38 doll hairs for everything that you see here. Please ignore the water. My dishwasher is draining into the sink. So let's go from left to right and tell you what's going on. Here at Winco, I got lasagna noodles and a bunch of canned tomatoes in order to make a ton of freezer lasagnas. I'm going to be making, oh, check it, four freezer lasagnas. Oh my goodness. And this coming from a person who doesn't even like lasagna all that much. So the huge five pound container of cottage cheese I got from my discount store, I'm gonna bust these out and stick them in the freezer. Some will be for me and my family and some are going to be for my friend who actually is having a pregnancy complication at the moment. Her baby has, I believe it's CDH and she will be spending four to six weeks at a hospital away from her family leading up to the birth. So I wanted to provide them with some freezer meals in her absence. I did not need these. Anyone that's seen my pantry ever knows I probably don't need chocolate chips, but look, I couldn't say no. Organic semi-sweet chocolate chips, $1.29. They had a ton more. I thought I did a really nice job at restraining myself and only getting four. So high five to me. Sell five, nice. I love the clearance guacamoles. These freeze beautifully. You do not have to eat them right away. And the holy guacamole is all 100% clean ingredients. It tastes amazing. One of my favorites. Dave loves hummus. We haven't had it in a while. So 79 cents. That was a pretty fun deal. The baked beans are going with tonight's dinner, which is ribs and mashed potatoes from the clearance potatoes I got from the discount store. We'll throw some baked beans in there along with the Brussels sprouts I got at the store also. So lots of sides to go with dinner tonight. I love it when this artisan lettuce is cheap like this, 99 cents for a huge container. Yay. So now I can meal prep some salads for Dave for lunches. He loves it when there's several salads in the fridge to just like grab in the morning. I have some plain low fat yogurt, 99 cents for this huge container. I wanted to try and make my own yogurt. I hope this is the right kind to use as a starter. Fingers crossed. They had their peppers today, three to a bag, 99 cents a bag. Uh, I thought we would add stuffed bell peppers to the meal plan. I love to pick up the burger patties when they're on clearance like this. The regular price on this guy is like $12 or something like that. So I've got two pounds of meat for just over like 2.75 a pound. Not the best I've ever seen, but not awful. And yay, carbs, mmm. When the croissants are less than a dollar, I love to get these. 60 cents for these four huge croissants. What do we like to do with these? My kids like to make egg and pepperoni sandwiches out of them for breakfast. And remember, there are six of us, so one package doesn't even feed us all. Good thing I found two. And this one's so cute. 80 cents for all of these baby mini ones. So maybe this will be like an after school snack or something. Ham and cheese sandwiches eat them plain with Nutella. I don't know yet, but my kids love it when we have croissants. I guarantee these three containers will be gone in the next two days. And none. There was another lady standing on the bakery clearance rack and I elbowed her in the face to get her out of the way so I could get all of these. That's a joke. I did not do that. But I did scream fire to get everybody out of the store so I could get these. I did not do that either. Okay, seriously, I grabbed one of the packages and threw it at her to distract her so I could scoop all of these with my arm into my cart. Seriously, if you believe that I did any of those things, you don't know me at all. Those are all jokes. Real truth, she didn't want them. I got them, so excited. They're going into the freezer. I don't know what we're gonna do with them, but we're gonna do something. I love these little baby ones for homemade pizzas. These, these and these make the best homemade pizzas. I love doing these. So 65 cents for the baby ones, 75 for the two count bigger ones. And I never see these little ones on clearance. So 80 cents for all of these little sandwich size guys. And look, they totally make sandwiches out of them. I think I need to do this. 
How cute are these? Oh, I can't tell you how exciting clearance non makes me. I, I can't even tell you. So that is everything I grabbed today. One last looky-loo for, what did I say? 38, 38 doll hairs, which is gonna feed us for like several days or a week or whatever. All four freezer lasagnas. I feel like this is a good deal. I feel like this is pretty solid. What do you guys think? Have you found any good deals where you live lately? Do you think I'm crazy for getting more chocolate chips? Does this section freak you out because you are doing low carb and you're so jelly? Mmm. Do you like lasagna or do you hate it? I need to know. I wish you well in your future clearance shopping endeavors and that you can feed yourself and your loved ones for a cheaper price as well. Thank you so much for joining and I will see you in the next video.